sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time. All right, Fuzz Pie Guy here. We're going to show you how to log into a Raspberry Pi using a USB to TLO uh, adapter. So I have this one here. Now this one here is the uh, CP2102. So uh, you could use a couple different ones for these, but this is the one that I had laying around. So anyway, we're going to use the ground, the RX, and TX off of the uh, USB here. My camera won't focus. There we go. So, what we're going to do is, here on the Pi, I'm just going to power it from the, from the uh, micro USB, so I'm not going to hook 5 volts from this. So, what we're going to do is, we're going to hook up the ground, which is the third one. Then, my RX, coming from my USB here, which is my red wire is going to go into the fifth pin down on the pie here so let me just get rid of that one two three four five then my tx coming from my usb adapter is going to go into the fourth pin down so and we'll go ahead and plug my, my ground wire. Let me plug this in here. And plug in our ground. All right, so ground orange is my TX, which is the fourth one. All right, so anyway, we have this hooked up. And we're just going to plug this into the pie. All right, so now what we need to do is make sure we have the driver installed. So if we go to the following website here, and I'll throw a link in the description to my uh, website for this information. And we click on download, and we'll go ahead and download the uh, Windows driver here. And I already have it installed. So if we go to Device Manager, as you can see there it is and if we plug it back in it pops back so right there we need to know what com that it's on so it's on com 3 <clears throat> but the first thing we need to do is enable the serial uh, on the uh, SD card to allow serial connection so what we need to do is edit the config. Now you could do this through <clears throat> the terminal or, or the desktop, but uh, we're just gonna do it through the uh, SD card. So we're gonna add the following text to the bottom of this file. And I'll put that on my website also. Save it. Close. Close. And we're going to go ahead and put this back in the uh, Pi and power it on. Alright, so we're going to use COM3. Then we're going to change our speed to... One one five two zero zero. Now we'll have to click enter for it to start, and there we go. So now, if we log in here, if I remember the password and We are logged in. All right. So 
this isn't the normal way that I'll log in, but we are logged in. So this is basically how you can log in using the serial on your uh, Raspberry Pi. Now, obviously, this ain't common to connect this way. It's a lot easier through SSH or whatnot, but if you don't have an internet connection and you need to get in and you don't have a monitor or anything like that, this is a good alternative to get in and change some things around if you need to. So, all right. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for another one.